गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स एंड ऑल माय डियर फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू योर ऑन यूट्यूब चैनल वॉइस ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स और जीडी क्लासेस के इसी क्रम में आज का अपना टॉपिक है यूटीजिंग कोशिश की जा रही है आपके लिए बेस्ट ऑफ मैटर प्रोवाइड करने की इसीलिए हर एस्पेक्ट हर तरह के डेटा को आपके टॉपिक में एड करने की कोशिश की जा रही है ताकि आपको अपने जी के लिए अच्छी से अच्छी प्रेपरेशन इन क्लासेस के थ्रू मिल सके वेल well, इसी क्रम में आगे बढ़ते हैं अपने टॉपिक ई टीजिंग के साथ ई टीजिंग फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी नीड टू नो वट इज दैट सेक्सुअल असल्ट और मेंटल सेक्सुअल हेरसमेंट ऑफ वुमेन इधर वर्बली और बाई डूइंग एंड मेकिंग वलगर जेस्टर इज डिफाइंड एज ई टीजिंग इट इज ऑल्सो कंसिडर्ड एज हेरसमेंट ऑफ वुमेन इट इंक्लूड्स वलगर बॉडी जेस्टर सेक्सुअल रिमार्क कमेंट्स विंकिंग विस्लिंग Staring and touching the woman in appropriately way, all these kind of mean behavior can lead to depression, suicide. If we talk about the data, among the thirty-six interviews participants who reported you teasing, sixty-one percent is reported feeling of anger, forty-seven of point two reported feeling of shame or humiliating, and approx more than one third reported feeling of fear, worry, mental and stress and tension incidents like eu teasing in a modern era in which we talk about the equality for women puts up a question where society stands at present then it has become a serious issue in the modern era once we talk about the equality here is a big question incidents like eu teasing are not acceptable when there are constitutional laws to curb such type of mean incidents here we can talk about the constitutional laws acts and provisions that curb such type of incidents the dignity of women and girl is being taken of various laws that are state in indian penal code 1860 ipc the act or behavior that hurt to the dignity of women is dealt with a few section of ipc section 2294 and section 509 of ipc are two section regarding to this if absence acts are committed in public or absence words are spoken in public then section 294 makes the punishment for such acts mandatory section 29 294 states that if any one does any absence acts in a public places or sing recite or utter any absence song word in public places or a place where is nearby public places and such an act causes annoyance to other then it will amount of an offense under section 294 the person will be punished with the imprisonment up to 3 months or fine or both the section is not gender specific so male or female can be a victim or the offender the penalty will depend upon the severity of the offense so here we can know about the many laws as well as the section 509 ipc a person who expresses word gesture acts with an intention to hurt the modesty of women that such person will be penalized under section 509 of ipc this section is also referred to as eu teasing sections after considering all the sections one can easily recognized that by the introducing these provisions and legislature intended that sort of aggression and misbehavior against the women and what modesty of women either by words or act will not be tolerated so there are strict laws there is constitutional laws provisions to curb these kind of incidents but if there is law then now a question emerges why our society is facing still such kind of incidents even now here we need to know that we can't just depend on laws or constitution here there is something need to be considered that society has some responsibility where there where there that kinds of movements or mean actions take place public places or nearby public places then public support is required as family members can't be together every time with the women girls then other people need to take the responsibility they need to raise their voice against any wrong action on public places like you teasing if local people those who are present they try to curb the you teasing if they provide support to the women then we can really control such type of 
mean actions. Here one more thing is considerable. If women express and if they change their attitude in which they try to take the strict action while complaining to police, they can inform to their family and if they face that kind of offensive action for the first time, they need to tell their families so the action can be taken at the first time. Then there will be a message for antisocial elements that women will not tolerate such type of things at all. And women are ready to give befitting reply. They will not tolerate anymore. Our education system is producing intelligency, but we are missing moral education. So here lack of morality can be the reason. As earlier, it was the primary things to prove to provide moral education to our youth. So before make an intelligent brain, we need to build a noble and goodness, nobility, humble behavior and respect for women as well as for our elders. We need to look back. We can learn from our culture. We need to learn from our recent or ancient culture where personalities like King Shivaji, Maharana Pratap, those who even tried to protect the modesty of women in any case, doesn't matter, they belong to the enemy's team. They used to worship their mother. They used to respect a lot. So the one thing cannot be sufficient to control such kind of incidents. There is law, there is police, there is constitutional things, but we need to work towards many way. We need to make the society aware. We need to aware the girls that they should take a strict action. If they don't take any strict action, it really encourages the person to do it more. And sometimes it leads to the dangerous thing. And sometimes it leads to the matter like suicide. So with the effort of each and everyone, with the support of society, with the support of present people at that time, at the time of incidents where it take place, if they raise their voice, if women, if women stands, they take strict action, they inform the police, they just inform the family members and they feel aware, they just need to be alert. With all these kind of support, with the, all these kind of work, we can really control a uh, incident like ear teasing. So then only it can be curbed completely. Like while supporting with each other, if society support police, if girls are educated, they are aware of these kind of things, they can know it can be curbed with some smartness, with some awareness. So guys, here we completed the topic with every kind of aspect and we'll be ready tomorrow with a new topic for all of you. And as I said, I'll try to best of matter for you. I will consider your reviews, your commands, whatever I get the best suggestion, I will try to implement in my topics for you. So, have a nice time. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat.